Matters upon earth are quickly moving to a conclusion but it would appear that it will be a forced situation and not by choice, and that is understandable in view of the events that are taking place. There is a degree of uncertainty as to what path to take to avoid a situation that might lead to an all-out war. Several issues are involved and anyone could spark off a global war and we say this with no desire to frighten you, but the facts must be faced. We for our part stand aside with no desire to interfere, but can spread ideas around that could lead to a more desirable outcome. Whatever the outcome we will be closely watching events and doing our best to influence those involved to bring about peaceful solutions. However, sometimes matters must be left to allow things to follow their own path. Whatever way events work out our presence will ensure matters do not get out of hand. Indeed we will control the energies so that the outcome is following a direction that can be used to change the outcome to a more acceptable conclusion. So much karma is being worked out and many souls on earth at this time are creating opportunities that will advance matters for a much better outcome. There is always hope regardless of the attempts of the dark ones to keep people down, and deny them their rightful place in the light. The battle is indeed between the dark and the light whatever shape or form it takes. At present the earth is in turmoil and it is surely difficult to see which direction it is going in. But there is always light at the end of the tunnel and it will grow stronger as the dark ones are prevented from succeeding with their plan to imprison the people of earth. Those of you who are working for the light are to be commended for your determination to ensure that the dark ones will not succeed in their attempts to embroil the whole earth in a pointless war that has already resulted in the deaths of so many souls. When will man ever learn that violence gets you nowhere at all, and only sets back your evolution by many years? However, since the end of the age gets closer and closer if must be apparent that it will bring about major changes that will leave the old behind that has no place in the higher vibrations. You have been working towards the new age for a long time and given every chance to rise up and even now you could do so. Clearly all souls upon the earth at this time are benefiting from their experiences in spite of the problems caused by the dark ones. It must seem very difficult to make sense of what is taking place, but be assured that there is a plan that will lead to a victory for the light. It was foreseen and anticipated eons of time ago and it will give much joy and happiness to those who will have earned their victory. Most humans are very resilient and once they have a target in their sight they are usually single-minded in their intention to succeed. Most of you are very experienced in facing challenges and have every faith in your ability to overcome whatever problems you meet. It is why we cheer you on knowing that you have faith in yourselves. You have little idea of your past adventures but do at times experience a certain feeling that you have led many lives. They have given you the faith you have in your own ability to tackle any problems that confront you, and indeed with your experience you can. What surprises await you when you ascend as you will find it far more exciting than you imagined and enjoy the peaceful feeling, after living a lot of your life fearing events taking place around you. You are blessed to be a masterly at all things and a whole vista of opportunity will open up before you. Life on earth is in no way like the one that you are soon to enjoy, and it will be far beyond your expectations. Perhaps you would find meeting old friends again very exciting and especially family members who you have fond memories for from your own experiences. Bear in mind that little of what you have become familiar with over your many lives will serve you much longer and gradually slip into the background. The lessons you came to learn have done their work, and you will carry the benefits with you into the higher dimensions that you are entering. Be assured nothing of value is left behind that can help serve your needs although you never stop learning. Your progress is carefully planned so that it is appropriate for your continued advancement. Your power of thought is continually growing and some of you will have already experienced unusual occurrences in this connection. For example it is the premonition that someone is about to contact and it could be by telephone, in general it is having a premonition of something you feel is about to happen. On a wider scale it could be a world event such as an earthquake, or major happening that you had no knowledge of beforehand. These are minor events to what you could eventually experience. You surely must realize that you are in reality a very powerful being and for the purpose of each incarnation you only carry those experiences that serve a purpose for that lifetime. Keep an open mind so that you do not miss out where information may help you in your quest for knowledge. Try to avoid obstructive and misleading information because the dark ones are forever trying to mislead you. 
Obviously your guides will have a hand in linking you with the right contacts so that you can continue evolving in a useful manner. There is too much negative news placed upon you through newspapers and TV and you could be forgiven for being misled by them. If something doesn't seem right it is possibly correct and you are best advised to set it aside until you can be sure about it. The most exciting experiences in the future for most people will be to meet those dear ones who have dropped their vibrations to help you evolve, and have followed your spiritual growth for a very long time. They serve you as they also have been served and know exactly what will help you succeed in your efforts to rise up. This type of response is typical of the help that is given you. You have so much to look forward to and it is why we give you every encouragement to stay firmly on the path given you that will help your continual progress. I leave you with love and blessings, and may the light brighten your days and path to completion. This message comes through my higher self my God self, and every soul has the same connection to God. In love and light. Mike Quincy